Hello, everybody. Welcome to episode 12 of Project Sky Q2, where uh, today we get this power set up. Uh, better power and more of it. How do we do it? Let's jump in and see. All right, guys. Uh, I'm getting tired of this basic uh power production we're, we're, we're producing okay on power but i would like to be able to produce a lot more uh especially seeing as how excuse me uh especially seeming as how uh i would like to get um a better sieving setup going here. So, uh, I'm going to make, let's see here, I'm going to need a building gadget. And can we get into flux? Let's look here. Uh, that requires us to flux blocks, obsidian block redstone dust flux block is should not be that hard to make five some obsidian eyes of ender we have eyes of ender okay blades okay Eyes of Ender. Do those have EMC? No. So then I was like, oh, we could actually EMC them. No. Still need to get a blaze for this farm here. Oh, and by the way, guys, uh, we've got a little army of Drigmies. That, that, that's why the walls have went up around them. Uh, to prevent them from falling out of the world what has happened in the past. Uh, I want to get more into different type of power and that type of stuff. And I'm showing you guys a little bit ahead here, probably next week in the videos. Uh, we're going to need to get... Yeah, let's get this. Let's uh, do this. Uh, metallurgic infuser. Uh, to go further, so. We did, we're with, mm, I can English. We really didn't want to go too far along this pathway. There we go. Okay, we've got us a metallurgic infuser, which completes a lot of quests for us. Oh, okay. I was like, wait, why is there no power on the left hand side? Um, we need five fuse infused alloys which are iron five I want a I want a uh, battery for these oof oof I need to clean this out I really do we're at another stack upgrade Be here, one of those. Yeah, let's let's make another stack upgrade. Oh, we have one. There we go. There we go. Easier to maintain that way. Uh, we need a basic control circuit, two energy tablets, which. 
basic control circuit is two osmium or one osmium, two redstone. All right, so now we can make the two of those the energy tablets. which is a very simple recipe. There's that. And that completed a lot of our quests um, along this pathway. Okay, so grab out the medium conveyance dust. And they want you to make a windmill for your second power. Uh, these gate pearls are awesome. And there is a blaze one. We would have to go get a metal press for that. And I mean, it's useful stuff. It the, the beginning quest, guys, if you haven't done them, do them. I'm skipping over them. I'm skipping around them somewhat. Uh, toss that in there. Uh, one of the things I want to do is get jetpacks, so that that is why we we need more power. But uh, basic energy cube, and I think we could actually make a more advanced energy cube. But to start with, steel. Steel is actually been one of our uh, one things that where we've been wasteful on. Uh, if we look here, it's four coal, one iron dust. If we go through the metallurgic infuser, it is 10 carbon to one enriched iron. And one enriched iron is one iron to one carbon, and, or 10 carbon. Uh, carbon is simply one of those gets us 10. So it literally is, there we go. Um, so much cheaper to produce it through the metallurgic infuser. Uh, and yeah, we do need this energy cube here yeah, we're just missing the steel, so uh, I'll be right back once we get the steel done. Okay, uh, with just a little bit of time here, uh, I put them into the iron furnace to produce uh, steel for us. And uh, I want to upgrade the iron furnace here soon. I think it's about that time to upgrade that as well, so... All right, steel casing. Now we should be able to do an energy cube. Uh, save it for later, storing power. Yes. Uh, I'm going to set the energy cube up right here for right now. And this can hold 1 million Fe for us. So, yeah. All right. Uh, let's look here. Let's uh, accept all of these quests so far.
and toss in the stuff that we received here. Uh, so now we could actually go to this building gadget, toss it in here. It drains the power out. It's plenty enough power for this, so. Once that's fully stored, we will have the building gadget. But like I said, I want to get us a jetpack. So we're going to get us leather straps here. Uh, I need 11 of these for the first tier. Really? Really? We're out of sticks. That's the first. Uh, Oh. All right, uh, like I said, we need 11 per upgrade uh, tier of this backpack. And I try not to go ahead of myself and produce more than I need. Uh, let's see here. I think we need two for the engines and three for the batteries. So this is the battery, the wood capacitor. So get those two made up. And now we have the wood jetpack. But there is... What? Okay, so we can upgrade this even more, like to the stone tier. Again, only making 11 of these at a time. Uh, another set of batteries make uh, five of these make one more of these I I did jump ahead there real quick uh, Two of those. Okay, so use for this. There we go. Now we have stone tier, which is still better than the previous tier. We can still do better. Uh, I'm going to go iron tier. Oh, see, this is why we don't make these too far ahead. Some gold here. All right, like I said, don't make too far ahead. So, here. Uh, and honestly, we could put this in here let it start charging up. We'll see how fun this is. Uh, now, I've got to remember what the initial buttons are. Okay, the speed is the arrow keys. But let me go in here to keybinds and say category jet uh iron jet packs there it is uh it is d and h okay and like now we can hover it's it's not uh, the best but you know it's 
good enough to help uh, improve uh, making that. And it is stored in your curio slot there. Uh, I'm going to upgrade this for a few moments and start work on a lower platform. And I'll meet you back uh, once I get done with that. And OK, I built a tiny platform here with a white elevator in the center. Uh, for facing south, but this one faces north, the one up here. Uh, you just got the arrows, let you know where they're at and everything. It's going to be very discombobulating. Um, all right, so I want this built gadget to use this one. Uh, and this out real quick and what I'm going to do is press G and I want to say uh, horizontal wall with anchor Uh, let's say a range of 15. Do another one, say range of 15 there. And uh, well, that's it for the building bricks that we do have. And if you ever want to undo something, you just press U and does it. Makes uh, building platforms so quick and painless. I think this is a good starting basement for us. Uh, I'm going to leave this guy here. But now, I want to improve our power uh, because our jetpack, uh, which I did go all the way up to Emerald tier, takes forever to charge. Okay. Partially because the energy cube is small, but mostly because these magnators are just basic ones. Uh, power has different levels we can go. Uh, to get to these different levels, we need uh, these lasers, they're energy rods, um, and a energy cube. So we've got the energy cube here, and I would like to get, I'm going to say three of these lasers, four, four of these lasers should be fine. You know what? Make five, make five. And we're going to need some of this particular rods. And we've got one. Two, three. Four. Uh, I do need to make more of these. Here. I don't think that's enough of what I, I need. But uh, we'll make that many. Uh, one more set of these. I said I wanted five of these. Now we're going to take these starters, make them into basic ones, which we need five more of these casings, it looks like. Uh, 
we're gonna need more paste. Uh, and we're out of clay, which we have clay here. Wish there was an easier way of doing this. Um, just put some of this down here. Let's see here. Break that. Four stacks of clay. Get some more of that. Okay, so what do we need? Uh, we need more of these. That's right. Uh, four more. Okay, so we've got those. And now we could do this and it needs now quartz which we have quartz spent time uh, sieving soul sand between episodes to get quartz uh, five of those so now back to uh, at power boom, boom right here and now we have uh, five of these rods So, to be able to use these rods, we're going to come off of this twice, and one, two, three, four, five, and six. I think we can use these for these guys here. Yeah, we can. This is only a temporary setup. Uh, until we get a little bit uh, more of a fine-tuned space for this. And we set down the energy orbs. Now, to make the next tier of magnators, we need the hardened uh, capacitors, which requires the energetic steel. The energetic steel is made with iron and gold in this guy. So we need, uh, say, a stack of iron, stack of gold, and we'll place this here, this here. We'll watch those lasers. They zap them quickly. And uh, just process this up for a little bit. It's relatively quick and painless. I think we need how much of this for the next tier of magmators? Five plus four is nine per each. So we have three, so we need 30 or 26. And if you put too many items in there, just right click with an empty hand and it'll take it out. So give me a moment to get this and uh, upgrade. At, let, let me upgrade at least one of these off camera or on camera for you guys so you see what I mean. Uh, Break this here. Should be powering that back up. Okay. So uh, we need two of these guys. Use. Uh, we need another one of these, which needs.
more those. All right, so let's see if we can get it this time. All right, so now we've got the hardened magnator and we can set this guy down here and he now generates 200 fe per tick while these guys produce 80 fe per tick so he is nearly uh 250 percent better than these guys so I'm going to take these guys, uh, I'm going to get the rest of the, these guys set up and, uh, I'm going to determine how much time we have left and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, uh, it's raining. It's going to be annoying. Um, one thing, these do make about 200 FE per tick can put out a 800 FE per tick. So, I mean, that, that's a lot of FE that it, it can produce and put out uh, per tick. Uh, one thing I want to do is show you guys this. Uh, pickaxe, here it is. Uh, we can upgrade these rods to higher tiers. It just takes more quartz. Uh, we'll just need five more quartz real quick. And these hardened capacitors of the tier that you want to upgrade it to. So, and all of these do require more casings. Um... And they, they can produce or put out more power per each one of these guys. Uh, but also, I wanted to upgrade this guy to a Harden. And show you the difference between Hardened and the... Uh, Blazing. Blazing can generate 800 FE per tick. Uh, so it's pretty much four times faster or more productive than those. But it does burn through our lava. It does burn through our lava production. So I'm going to need to make some more superheated elements. Uh, I'm going to set those up downstairs which you guys probably saw in the intro. I'm going to set these guys up and I'll probably make these generators um, at power. These lava generators, uh, I'll probably get them all the way up to spirited. Now, to make these, we just need the niotic crystals, which is just diamond and spirited is just emerald through them so yeah i i think we can get those guys up to that tier uh this was recorded live over on twitch uh so if you guys ever do want to stop by say hi see how this is recorded stonebreaker Give me a second. We'll, we'll gladly take Stonebreaker. Uh, emeralds, emeralds, emeralds. Uh, stop by, say hi, join the Discord as well. Um, we are taking people onto the server. So stop by, say hi, join the Discord, 
And, uh, if you did enjoy this episode, hit that like button. If you dislike this episode, hit that dislike button. And until next time, later, Gators.